President Barack Obama, after this lunch with the new leaders of Congress, has authorized the deployment of another 1,500 U.S. troops to Iraq. The soldiers will boost Iraqi forces fighting the militant group Islamic State following a request from Iraq's government. Their role will be non-combat, and it's believed they could be in place before the end of the year. It's being done now, quite frankly, because uh, the Iraqis have reached... Uh, 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 they, have, they have demonstrated the willingness and the skill to go after ISIL. So they've reached a point uh, where they need uh, additional help and guidance. The new troops will train nine Iraqi army and three Kurdish Peshmerga brigades in several sites. They will join several hundred U.S. military advisors who are already assisting the Iraqi army. The Pentagon also announced the U.S. military would be setting up what it called advise and assist operations centers outside Baghdad and the northern city of Erbil.